Welcome to the Big Movie Mouth Off on Xfinity, Utah On Demand, Salt Lake Alternative. I'm Jimmy Martin with Slug Magazine. I'm Jeff Weiss from MSN Entertainment. Today we're sponsored by PC Laptops. We're at Brewbies reviewing some movies today, and today we're going to be reviewing Rabbit Hole. Yeah, a uh, lost drama directed by John Cameron Mitchell, who you might remember from Head Begin the Angry Inch. He's adapted the Davy David Lindsay A Bear stage play about parents who are played in this version by Nicole Kidman and Aaron Eckhart who have lost a son and it's shattered their relationship. She, uh, you know, she visits me sometimes in dreams and uh, tells me it's okay. And she's with God. God had to take her. He needed another angel. He needed another angel. Why didn't he just make one? Another angel. I mean... He's God, after all. Why didn't he just make another angel? Hmm? I forget that he's not here sometimes. Like, maybe he's just hiding under the bed and he's gonna pop out like he used to do. He's trying to make things nice. You can't. Well, I you, you go into a movie like this. And just, you don't expect it to be able to feel good. No, I mean, you, you, you know the plot when you're kind of going into it. And, and is it a cheap shot? Because, I mean, there's, there's such a way to evoke emotion from somebody. And it's right. the death of a child. But, oh, man, Aaron Eckhart and Nicole Kidman dominate this film from start to finish. I mean, I've, I haven't seen Nicole Kidman act like this in a long time. Um, and it's, it's great. Aaron Eckhart is one of the strongest performances I think I've seen of the year. Yeah, he, I think he's an underrated actor, and I, don't, I, I think people don't remember where he came from. He's got a background with uh, Neil LeBute and things yeah. like in the Company of Men. This is his first really, really, really strong performance in, in quite a while, and he gets an interesting subplot where... He's willing to go to grief counseling for a support group while she is not. Yeah. I mean, talk about uh, a film that explores the ups and downs of a marriage, uh, you know, brought basically, you know, shattered apart, and can you put the pieces back together when one is actually trying to go a more traditional route where the wife is actually ex exploring, without giving too much away, uh, another outlet. Unorthodox <laughs> means. Yeah. Although um, he uses some un unorthodox means as well. He does. It's called pot. Yeah. <laughs> yes. But it, I, you know, I really like this film. I think the acting was absolutely brilliant. It's, what, it's, it's hard to promote a film like this to say, go see it. I mean, you want to, yeah. but you are not going to feel good when you come out of it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, if, if I have problems with it, it's that we've, when I say grief drama, it's become the bugaboo of independent drama. Yes. It's, it's a story that's told a lot, and it, again, this is based on a stage play, and there's only so much you can do with a stage play to, as they say, open it up to a film. And it's almost a film stage play, which if you're a fan of stage plays and, yeah. and character interactions and strong performances, you're going to like the movie. I'm not sure it's the most visually interesting depiction that we could have gotten out of the film, but again, the performances are very strong. In particular, Aaron Eckhart and Diane Weiss. I was just about who, to mention that one. Who, who plays the mother, <laughs> it, uh, the grandmother. Yeah, of, she plays Nicole Kidman's mom, who, yeah. Yeah, who can uh, relate to her situation. Yeah, an underrated actress who you might remember, well, hopefully you remember from some Woody Allen films. And I remember her from Parenthood. Yeah, she's a terrific <laughs> actress. She is great in it, and for the performances, I give it two and a half stars. You know, I'm, I'm right above you, because it's one of those films that the only way to, to carry it through would be the performances, Right. and I would give it three stars based on that. So, great film. <laughs>